Hello everyone. In this short tutorial, I'll be showing how to introduce various multiple legends into a single figure. Uh, often this happens that we need uh, plot multiple graphs in one figure, and we have to name each of the graph uh, for the sake of comparison. So I'll be taking the example of uh, sine, and f for that, I'll be introducing a vector empty from 0 with a resolution of 0.1 up to 2 pi that will be a full cycle after that uh, I'll be putting this T into this sign and getting something out of it so when I plot it like this one T against A I'll get this figure this whole one single sign sign cycle so what i gonna do if i have to plot an other graph and other uh, plot into this figure i have to do this like introduce some figure with a number like this figure figure number one and do this one do this thing so for single thing if I want to introduce a legend it's very easy like this sine wave 1 okay so let's do it so when I uh, plot it it is this sine and sine wave 1 okay so now what I want to do I want to plot in other wave of different frequency or any other figure that is uh, capable of being plotted in MATLAB into this figure and see how it differs from the original one so okay let's do it S for that I will be doing hold on and then introduce in other variable uh, with a different argument in it like this I want to introduce this B into same function sine and inside T into 2 obviously the arguments inside if they change they change the frequency of the sine wave so let's see it I'm gonna do this plot T comma B okay so when I run this code let us see what happens okay so this is the frequency having twice as frequency as the previous one so two cycles into 2 pi one cycle the blue one and the two cycles on the orange one so what is this data how to uh, put it uh, like here how to represent it here even if the legend is the last line in the code it doesn't associate itself with the second plot it associates itself with the first plot you can see this one the blue one the first plot not the second one likewise uh, if I want to plot the third thing like the previous one sign sorry t into 3 and plot t comma c as I have activated this hold on thing so I can plot as much plots graphs into this figure 1 so again by running this one I'm getting this third graph and uh, still with one legend that is associated with the uh, still with the blue line the first graph so here's the problem I wanna name each of these plots using a single legend command how can I do that there's a little little thing you have to do it is you have to name 
these plots uh, like uh, let's suppose I'm naming this plot as a QQ and the second plot is a WW and the third plot is a EE like I'm following the convention of keyboard QWERT sorry so as I have named each of these plots what I have to do now I'll be introducing a big bracket comma and inside the bracket I'll be putting the names of my plots Q Q W W E E so Q Q W W E E whatever the name it is so these are three plots and these are three names of the uh, graphs that I wanna give so first one is the sine wave 1 comma sine wave 2 comma sine wave 3 so let's run this code I wanna close this figure first and see this one voila that's it so the first sine wave is the blue one the second one is the red one and the third one is the orange one so in this way you can add as much legends specify the uh, specific graph what it's its name what it is purpose anything any information you wanna put in there so that's it i think this helps in future happy research thank you